Namaste everyone. Welcome to the day two of anxiety relief series. I hope you all felt good in your root chakra after balancing it. Today we'll work on our Swadhishthan chakra, that is the sacral chakra. It is the second chakra when going upwards from the base of the spine. Sacral chakra is responsible for our sensuality, our sexual behaviors, our creativity. To balance this chakra, we will just imagine an orange light, an orange energy pulsating in this chakra. So beginning, I hope you have the crystal or rock, whichever totem you're using with you, like I have this one. Keep imagining that it is absorbing all the energy that is no longer serving you. Place it in your right hand. Close the fist and put it in your lap and just relax it there. And as we work on our chakras, you imagine that any energy that is no longer serving you is slowly and gradually transferring into your crystal. Beginning, close your eyes. Draw a deep breath in. And as you exhale, exhale from your mouth. Draw another deep breath in, exhaling from the mouth, take another deep breath in and this time hold that breath inside and exhale by relaxing the body more and more. Now begin with taking your attention to your legs your knees, your thighs, the blood circulation in your legs. Take your attention to your bones, the cells, the tissues, the muscles. And as you exhale, relax this area, gently letting it fall onto the surface where you're resting. Draw another deep breath in Take your attention to your hip, your lower back, your lower abdomen, the sides of the body, observing all organs in this area. And draw in a deep breath to energize. Any blockages that you feel in this area, let energy go to that area. And as you exhale, relax and release. Now take your attention to your navel, your upper abdomen, your mid back, your diaphragm, base of the rib cage, filling in energy in all parts, all areas, corners of the body. And as you exhale, let this fall gently onto the surface that you're resting on. Take your attention to your rib cage, your lungs, your heart, your shoulder blades, your shoulders. Observe the movement in this area and notice the muscles in the shoulder blades. With the next exhalation, Relax and release this area completely. Become aware of the gravity and see how the center of your body and your legs is absolutely relaxed and going down and down and down. Now take your attention to both your arms, your left arm, your right arm. Become aware of your elbows, your forearm, your biceps, the muscles, the blood flow in this area. Take your attention to the palms and into the right palm in which you have your crystal to absorb any energy that you no longer wish. Releasing out any blockages, any heaviness, 
stored in your sacral chakra as you sit for today's meditation. Let that crystal or rock know that you want to work in harmony with it and request it for its help to let you transfer anything that is deep-rooted, kept over years or many, many lives. And now take your attention to your neck, your vocal cords, your jaw. Relaxing and clenching the jaw. Relaxing the muscles in the neck. Calming down your throat from excessive speaking. Relax, relax, relax. Taking your attention to your ears and the muscles surrounding the ears. Letting it drop down. Relaxing your scalp and the muscles in the head. Creating a new space. Letting a smile gently come on your face to melt away any stress that you have been carrying on your face. Relax your forehead. Ease down the muscles in this area. Gently relaxing your cheeks and now your eyes, letting it drop down and let your eyes now shut deeply, choosing to only look within, letting only those images come forward that will help you in recreating your life in a productive and powerful manner. Now take your attention to the tip of your nose, observing the air going in and circulating within your body and the air coming out of your nose, releasing anything that is no longer serving you. With every breath you take, try and observe where is the oxygen going to. Observe where it goes in your scalp or in the back of your body or in your feet. Allow it to reach every corner of your body. You can visualize this air to be bright white in color. Clearing out, lighting up, illuminating every space that it crawls through. Just for a moment, observe if there are any dark places within the body where this light is unable to reach. Focus on that area and draw a deeper breath in, letting this light reach to that area. And with daily practice, you will be able to see this illumination reach every corner of your body. You will be able to feel any area that is lacking energy and you will be able to draw in healing energy into that region. And today, let's work on our sacral chakra. This chakra is orange in color. Your beautiful Swadhisthan chakra. This chakra is responsible for your creativity, your sensuality, your sexual behaviors. When it is balanced, it provides you with a wonderful creative energy to formulate great ideas and solutions to everyday problems and new innovative ideas and visions to help you lead a powerful life. When we are anxious, we begin disturbing our sacral chakra. We do not feel adequate or capable to resolve whatever challenge lies in front of us. And with the criticism that we operate with, 
we make this chakra become weaker. Once we can re-energize our chakra, we regain our creative abilities, opening ourselves to the possibilities of solutions that can come from all our experiences in life, whether positive or negative. When this chakra is balanced, you will always find a new creative energy to the same old problems. You will feel the power of the universe flow through you and your ability to connect and influence others while remaining in your power and while being grounded. There is always a solution even if you cannot see it. And when your sacral chakra is balanced, you start observing the solutions that lie in plain sight. So to balance this chakra today and remove any negativity stored or any harm that we have done to our sacral chakra over the years of our anxiety, we will begin chanting our mantra, Ahim. But along with that, on every Ahim, we will release any dark, grayish, murkish energy stored in this chakra. Take all your attention to your sacral chakra, two fingers below your navel, and you can visualize an orange energy filling it up, becoming brighter on every chant. Ultimately, filling your entire room with a bright orange energy. And let's begin with our chant, drawing in a deep breath into the sacral chakra. You can chant this quietly in your head or softly aloud Ahim 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 and relax. The mantra Ahim disintegrates any heaviness of energy that has been stored in any chakras for over years. You can continue chanting a hymn in your mind every time you feel that this chakra needs more power, more balancing. For greater results, chant more of a hymn even after this video. And now draw in a beautiful orange energy into your sacral chakra and energize this chakra, sending in the affirmations, I am connected to my higher self. I am creative and connected with my creativity. I am aware of my power. I am worthy. 
I accept my sensuality. I accept my sexuality. I accept and balance my urges and desires in a way that they serve their best purpose in helping me fulfill my goals in life. I ask for my sacral chakra to be balanced. I ask for my sacral chakra to be active. I operate from the perfect balance of my sacral chakra. I allow myself to see the solutions that lie around me. I pulsate with my energy, owning up to my power, my worthiness. I choose to create from a gratitude state of mind. I give my gratitude for everything that I have. And just feel your body being surrounded by a wonderful orange light. Like a warm blanket on your body, soaring you with confidence, new creative ideas, wonderful energy once you have completed your affirmations. Stay in this energy, letting the orange light surrounding you and seeping into your sacral chakra energizing it with every breath. Observe your breath going into your sacral chakra. Every time empowering your sacral chakra, your lower abdomen, bringing more relaxations in the muscles and nerve centers in this area. Allow this energy to re-empower, recalibrate your mind, your body to lead a life that is more energized, more creative, more charged with love. Take a moment to give your gratitude to all the organs in your lower abdomen. Allow yourself to see the greatest version of yourself as you would operate, behave, walk when you have left your anxiety behind. And try and connect to the cause of this. What is the lesson that my anxiety wants to teach me. Anxiety usually happens when your mind is going faster than your actions. Where is my mind trying to go that I'm unaware of? I'm breathing another healing energy breath and breathe in another deep breath asking your body to give you answers and the power to take right actions from your highest self to match up with the power of your mind. Allow that balance to go into your sacral chakra now. Balancing it, calming it, strengthening the muscles, strengthening the cells and tissues in this area to hold you and support you in times and situations that seem hard to you. 
but solvable from now on. Breathing in deep. And relax here for a few moments. Letting any more release to happen if it requires to be. Letting it directly transfer to the stone that you're holding in your right hand to absorb more energy that is no longer serving you or causing distractions to be released, removed and recycled. Observing how deep has your breath become. Seeing the path of your breath till your base of the spine and your sacral chakra. Charging and nourishing your lower abdomen. Your root chakra is still in balance from yesterday's activity and now it is getting linked and connected to your sacral chakra to find creative and wonderful ways of providing you security, stability and ideas that generate a well-balanced physical well-being. Breathe in to your navel and to the base of your spine, feeling the balance and more connected with yourself and the world from now on. And slowly bringing this energy back into your physical world with a smile on your face, slowly start to bring your consciousness back. I will count from five to one and with every count, you will release whatever is left and not serving you, making your body and mind quieter while your energy expanding into the full room, vibrating at a high energy. Five, with a smile on your face. Four, more charged up, more energized, more secure. Three, pulsating with this new energy to take charge and find creative solutions to every situation. Two, connected to your masculine and feminine side. Balance in your yin yang. One, and slowly wiggling your fingers and your toes. Bring the palms together. Thank the rock your crystal for working on you today and slowly open your eyes, welcome back. And relax. So use this on day two and for better results, you can use both the first video and this video together. Make sure you do not use this while driving or operating heavy machinery. And I wish wonderful things for you Check back tomorrow for the next meditation. Goodbye. Namaste.